Yeah, I went out and got another load. I heaped it up pretty good. I want to see how this will fit in my woodshed. Got the log splitter back home again. Now you see this stuff here is all dry from last year. I got to remove it out of the woodshed. Throw it over here. Because what I want to do is keep that stuff out front in case it gets cold during the summer. Now you see when I leave a load of wood overnight in the woodshed, I put the jack under it. And that hydraulic jack there, the floor jack, it's lost a bunch of oil, so I have to use the jack all to keep the weight off the springs. So I just have to darn well do it. Sitting around looking at it, not gonna get done. Toss the stuff all out of the woodshed. Put all the wet stuff in, the newly cut stuff, and then put that stuff back later so it's out front. And you see how I put pellets down there just to help circulate the air and keep the wood out of the dirt? Yeah, okay. Time to fire up the engine, turn on the fuel. Yep. Okay. Everything's gonna work. Okay now. Split it all up. I try to use the four blade splitter as much as I can just to speed things up. A lot of times. Just a single blade, less clumsy, more power. But, uh, you know, you get to, to figure out what works best, single blade or four blade. first wood I put on this truck you can, is buried behind all this big stuff, but it's a smaller alder that just takes, uh, you know, the four blade just splits it into four pieces. It's just perfect. That stuff goes pretty fast when you do that, but when you're fooling around with the big stuff, you have to break it down. It's a little bit more fooling around. do uh, one row because there's five rows in the truck. So I do one row, then stack it in the woodshed. Go back to another row, stack that in the woodshed. And it kind of gives everybody a break, especially me. <laughs> but, uh, you know, I got close neighbors. Gives me a Four pieces just like that. Speeds things up pretty good. And uh, I got the back half of the woodshed full in my neighbor's yard. I get wood for him too, and I got a stack of pellets there so when he finishes the wood they can go on the on the ground. So there's what one row of wood looks like stacked up in there. And now the next row is split. There it is stacked up. Two rows. Now do the next one. Keep going like that. No sense lollygagging around. Just keep doing it until it's done. There, that's about as high as I want to put it in the woodshed, I think. These guys are gonna keep an eye on the, on the wood. Oh yeah, this guy gets his lips flapping once in a while. Yeah, there it is. I stacked it up higher this year than I usually do. Yeah, I think there's two rolls left. 
see what it gets to here. There. Let's take that up. Okay. What? One more roll left. Judy says supper's ready, so I better get in a hurry. I have to put a block of wood there because it rains. I have to stop the rain from getting on the iPad, iPod, iPhone, I mean. iPhone 12, it takes pretty big pictures. Stack it up in here. So there's a load of firewood stacked in the shed. So one more load will be more than I need. See you later.